Aikisha, can you please tell us what makes you think that Aikida is making up the story about being molested? Her perception is, is twisted about a lot of things. Um, why she wants to always try to one-up me and choose that story doesn't make sense. But she always tries to one-up me, and I don't even give a rats about trying to one-up her. That's my sister. You know, it's like she will find any and every reason to fight with me. And it's kind of funny when you think about it. It's like she, she won't take accountability for a lot of things that she does and instead throws it on me. Nikita, I just want to acknowledge you. I mean, it is a serious accusation to say that somebody would want to make up such a horrible thing as sexual molestation. And, yeah, and I never said that she tried, she tried to make it up. I just said I have not heard what actually happened that day. I just know how far it went. And I felt more traumatized from the whole thing because of what actually did happen to me. I know what happened. I remember and I, the first person I told was her and I've told it over and over and over and over and over and over and over. Can you both accept that you were molested and then yes. feel empathy for each other? I, it doesn't I have, have to be I either or. You both things. were in a very difficult yeah, home environment. I, I always had empathy until I, the certain family members came forward and told me about the results of the rape kit, proved there was no rape. Aikida, just because there was no evidence on a rape kit I doesn't right. mean that molestation did not happen. I didn't say it didn't happen. She's the one who said it might not happen. She and you know what? Let's, I mean, let's just give this I think a more minute. More highly of her, like, why would you I not know. tell but her Aikisha that it? And Aikida, let's why give this a minute. Tell? Why would you let it happen? And okay. I'm next. Hey, Deep breath. Let it happen? If it Deep happened, breath. I don't know what you're talking about. You're the one who stayed home, so it means you let it happen. Where's your mom in this equation? Not sure exactly where she was at that year in our life, but she was never an active parent in our life. Our great grandmother always wanted her to be around. Mm -hmm. She was the only one in the family who's ever just never just took care of her kids, you know, so they would let her come back. They let her spend the night. They believed in her and she never, oh. you know, no. she so grandma had time. stepped in when your mom was great. away and yeah, raised you. We always lived in my grandfather's one, house or great grandmother. But, but I, I want to focus on what you just brought up, which is, yes, it was great that your grandparents raised you, but also and they, they did not make the home safe all the time. It was always safe. It was, about it was safe except for that when, when your mom was married. No, it when mom came, it wasn't in. safe sometimes. It wasn't safe when I mean, he was, did, did what he did to us. Right. And I told, and I remember when we were little, because I would have, I would have dreams about stuff that's gonna happen. And I remember, I was eight years yeah. old before he moved in. I don't know how. I remember no, her saying. I don't know I how long. That. Okay. Ooh, I don't know how long it was. Oh my God. <laughs> You guys are gorgeous. And we saw these really cute photos of you guys side by side as babies. Oh, we were babies. Yeah. Oh, they were oh, guys. So cute. Now, see, see, now, this way. No, that's this me on the left. You guys both have been through trauma. Both of you are angry for some reason. Yeah. But you have an opportunity today to not only heal that, but move forward. And really, both of you are here because you know you want a relationship. You know you love each other deep down. Right, but I, my, my thing is, like, she'll say <laughs> but, something. <laughs> no, but. No, I want, oh, we, you, okay. you're right. That's <laughs> Hold on, just one, one thing, one minute. Can you can you acknowledge that you want a relationship with your sister? Absolutely, just, 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 I you know, do. No. Absolutely. Yes. Do you love your sister? Yeah, un unconditionally. I'd give her my heart and die if she needed it. Really? Oh. Okay, yes. Oh. Yeah, okay, yes. Okay, no, because I know I'd be going to heaven.